What do you have to say? What do I have to say? Why do you think it's important to vote? I vote for our servicemen and women. I vote because it's my right. I vote for the environment. For the full inclusion and independence of people with disabilities. For a greener world. I vote for a brighter tomorrow. I vote for... I vote for... I vote for our civil liberties. Freedom of life, freedom of happiness. Hope everybody can keep a smile like I can have one. I vote... I vote... I vote... I vote... I vote. For my community. I vote for freedom of choice. In this country, voting is one of our most basic and important rights. When you go to the polls, you're voicing your opinion on the laws and policies that directly affect you. And your vote really does matter. In the last election, many candidates won by just a few hundred votes. Broome County now has new voting machines that use both paper ballots and electronic tallying, making voting faster, easier, and more accurate than ever before. For the first time in history, these machines will allow people with disabilities to vote independently, along with their non-disabled peers. If you've never voted or have recently moved, make sure you register to vote before heading to the polls. You can find a registration form at your local post office, the Board of Elections, or on our website, gobroomcounty.com slash elections. When you get to the polling station, check in with one of the inspectors and receive a paper ballot. Then you'll go to a private polling station and mark your choices. To make your selection, fill in the box next to the candidate. Make sure you blacken the boxes completely, or the voting machine will prompt you to redo it correctly. If you make a mistake and need to change your selection, return your ballot to an inspector, who will exchange it for a new one. If you think you'll have trouble reading or marking your paper ballot, you can use the new voting machine to mark a ballot. I would like to use the new machine. Yes. The controls are easy to use and you can enlarge the text, allowing you to cast your vote accurately and independently. Once you've made your choices, review your selections to make sure they are correct. If you're using the ballot marking device, once you're satisfied your choices have been made correctly, the machine will print your ballot with all of your selections filled in. Whether you've used the ballot marking device or a pen to mark your ballot, you'll then take the ballot to the new voting machine to be scanned. Insert your ballot into the voting machine and wait for the ballot successfully cast message. Congratulations! Your vote has been counted. When the polls close, the locked voting machine is sealed and transported to a secure warehouse, where it's stored until the election results are certified. It's important to vote because if you don't vote, you can't complain. I believe, uh, as Americans, it's our duty. I vote because my opinion is still worth a great deal. If we don't do it, then we leave it up to somebody else. They've made the choice for us. We shouldn't do that. Get out and register. Voters with disabilities now have the option of accessible voting. When you're signing in, simply tell the inspector that you would like to use the accessible voting machine. The new voting machine is designed to work in a variety of ways, depending on your disability or individual need. You can choose what works best for you. And is it all right if I put your headphones on? Please do. Okay. If your vision is impaired, the machine will either read the instructions and options to you through headphones, or you'll have the option of enlarging the text on the screen. You then make your selection with an easy-to-use handheld selection tool. With the tool, you can make and change your selections. It also allows you to write in candidate names using on-screen or auditory prompts. For those voters with limited mobility, paddles or a sip and puff device can be used to make your selections.
Once your ballot has been filled in on the ballot marking part of the machine, your ballot is printed. Take that to the scanner and insert your ballot. That's all there is to it. Congratulations, your vote has been counted. Whether you use a pen or a ballot marking device, whether it's your first time voting or your 61st time, the new voting machines ensure that the voting process is easy, quick, and accurate. So let your vote be counted this election day. Head out to the polls and help shape the future of your community.